by Sophie Lewis updated on January 23, 2019 4 15 a.m. CBS News WAG, the so-called Uber app of dog walking, has allegedly tried to buy a couple's silence after their dog died under the care of a WAG dog walker. The company has since issued an apology saying they are deeply saddened by what happened. Sarah and Nick Moore, of Houston, Texas, were semi-active users of the app prior to their dog's death. In August 2018, the couple hired a walker to stay in their home and take care of their dog, Winnie, during a 10-day vacation. That walker fell in love with Winnie and Winnie fell in love with her, Nick told CBS News. Winnie the Wheaton at Murav Winnie on Instagram Nick Moore on December 10. The Moores had to hire a walker on WAG at the last minute. So they used the first walker that was available. Sarah was skeptical of the walker from the beginning. The name on her profile did not match up with the name in her description. And she did not respond when Sarah asked for her name. Sarah's concern escalated when she did not receive the standard confirmation the walk had ended. Over the phone, the walker confirmed to Sarah that Winnie was safe. But shortly after, Sarah received a call from a WAG representative saying otherwise. Winnie had been struck by a car and did not survive. The Moors immediately rushed home. When we walked in and saw Winnie's empty crate I began to cry uncontrollably, Nick said. They learned Winnie was at a nearby pet hospital, but they still don't know who took her there or how. We went to the hospital to say goodbye. It was the hardest thing we've ever had to do. We took the next day off.